this will be my first uh, horror. I mean, I have Slender. Really fun game. And I have played all the Resident Evil, but they're not really horror. They're action, basically. But uh, this is supposed to be a little horror adventure. A unique horror adventure. Oh, with automatic save points, okay. Okay, so you can put it... Okay, so if you... Hmm. Apparently, you can complete this in a single sitting in an hour and a half. Okay. Hmm. Well, this was just going to be a short little... Hey, let's see what this is about, but, um... Yeah. Okay. Turn up the sound, turn off the lights. Alright, let, let me, let's see if I like it. And I may just do a whole walkthrough, you know? We'll see. Let's just, uh, let's just get, get it rolling. All I remember that night, at night, all I remember at that point was finding myself alone, okay? Where was I? It was so dark flashlight oh I'm a man with red hair okay so I can open you oh rumbles there's rumbling oh shit oh well, you want to leave that do oh <laughs> you little bastard Another door. There's a big ass house apparently. All right, this is obviously a dead guy, and I was just gonna leave you there, dude. But um, I feel like you're important to the plot, so I guess I should check you. Ew. Okay. All right. What's that? How did I hurt my leg, I wonder? All I could really recall was coming home, seeing Rachel. I was upset. She looked afraid. I knew I should head downstairs, try to find a way out. So now I'm downstairs? Yes. There's another floor. The hell is this? Do I free it? Yeah. I'm not gonna just leave it there. Look for key. Seemed like the owner of the house really knew the area. Hmm. Look, another door. I'm gonna get lost. Oh. Oh. A black and white photo. Look like the man upstairs and his wife, I guess. Yeah, take it. It may. I don't know. Let's find out. This is a big ass house. What are you doing in this house all by yourself? Okay, before I go downstairs, I want to check this door. Because I didn't check the door upstairs. I figured it would just be another room. But I may actually go back upstairs to check that door before I come back downstairs. Because I don't want to just keep going downstairs and then forget about that door. A collection of rusty tools. Why weren't they in a shed? How do you know there is a shed, sir? He is so suspicious. A photo similar to the old one I picked up. It's been moved a lot. Did I push the switch? 
Yeah. Cool. Yeah, do everything, dude. Don't even think about it. Just do it. That's how I live my life. <laughs> and it is working swimmingly. Alright, before I go downstairs, because I know he said I want to go downstairs, there is a door over here. Leaky ass. Another bookshelf. A computer. Yeah, open it. Dude. Oh. Oh. Oh, snap. Blood on your pants. Blood in a big old corner. Look, I feel like he's walking faster. <laughs> Blood on your pants, blood in the wall. Guy over here dead. And the whole time you're just like, man, I gotta get the fuck out of here. Pick up the fucking phone, dude. Call somebody. So you've been outside while it was raining. You're the murderer. We all know it. Some leftover negatives were sticking out, but they were pretty blurry. Tree tops, huh? Not now? Okay. Front door was blocked by a pile of furniture. Holy shit. Man, somebody was just. What was that? at the front door? No. Well, in the bathroom. Is it gonna go off again? It did not. That looks suspicious. You know, in situations like these, when you just find a random dead body on the ground, and you find a, a room boarded up, I just walk away, man. I just keep walking. I just keep walking down that bright shiny walkway and uh i just leave all that shit behind but um you seem very curious you know you seem like the curious curious nancy so uh that is that's gonna get you in a lot of trouble if it hasn't already you are covered in blood dude ugh you have just you've been chopping up folks and cooking them in their own kitchen that's what you've been doing what's that oh check that out yeah move it always do stuff first and then think about it later later yeah go down there I'm gonna get myself killed. <laughs> okay, now I'm in the fucking basement. This is creepy. Hmm. Places all over were marked on the old map of town. The industrial area, blah, 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 yak, yak, yak. Newspaper clippings from, okay. So, obviously a crazy person lives down here. Th this is like, mappings on the walls, old news clippings on the walls, and a dank basement. That's murder 101. That's what they teach you in school. That is how you become a murderer so that you can be on how to catch a murderer. Just saying.
A handgun? Yeah, take it. You've already killed. I think we all know that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Stack of old papers covered with what look like names. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's a hit list, dude. Hmm. Oh, look, a door. All right, before we go through the door, though, do these stores... Okay, I want to... Okay. Crudely made shelves. This is like a horrible basement. Like a basement within a basement. Ah, it's never good. That is there more basement? Dude. Seriously. Dude. This is fucked up. You you are heading into you are heading into somewhere, dude. You just need to stop. Oh jeez. Look, you better hope you are the killer, sir, because this does not look like a good time for you. Uh. Ugh. This is like Outlast all over again in pixel form. Just telling you. All right, why not? Another door. These boxes have old clothes in them. Clothes you remember throwing out after Rachel and I moved to town. The hell were they doing there? Those are all good questions, Bob. I've decided to name him Bob. My God, who built this house? Yeah, take it. Take it. Stop asking me and just take shit. Oh, snap. Did you, do you see this dude? Do you see this? You, we don't want to comment on that? Well, I guess I can see it, but he can't see it. Man, you are in deep shit. Did I climb? Oh, did I climb down? Yeah, you did. <laughs> Why not? Oh. Oh. There's nothing down here. False alarm. Everything's fine. Oh. Another door, huh? Hmm. I feel like these are bad ideas. But I also feel like... You like making those types of choices. You know? I feel like you could have fucking moved that furniture is basically what I'm trying to say, Bob. And now we're in the third layer of this basement. I'm using quotations here. In this creepy, creepy ass house. With a skeleton. And a dead body. And a taped up room. Ugh. I like you, Bob. Let's make bad decisions together. Okay. More.
more clipping. Oh, there's a walkway. I could still feel a faint impression of the rope I had slid down as I pressed against the heavy metal door. A lot of familiar things going on here. Hmm. Okay. Oh look, I can finally go up. Ugh, damn. <sighs> More doors. All right. probably water because we're in the pipes dude oh look an exit uh, yeah an exit sure yeah take it <laughs> well you do now oh boy <sighs> so we have an exit Another door. And a ladder back there. I smell a trap that is just so strong. It's literally knocking me out right now. I heard a bang. And we have two doors. And then another door. Oh boy. This is getting interesting. First door it is. Okay, it's locked. Second door. The fuck is that noise? Yeah, why not? Okay, that's that. <laughs> I'm just gonna touch everything, grab everything, hit everything. Who cares? Psst. What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> it's that noise again. Another valve. Another door. Okay. Valving up. Yep. Oh, the noise didn't stop this time. There it is again. Three and four. No more doors. Okay. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm not sure what they do. Doesn't matter. Hit them. Uh huh. I'm aware. I don't know what they do, but I'm going to hit them anyway. And that's how you make decisions, folks. Alright. There we go. Actually, should I have tried that door? I'm going to try that door again. Locked. Okay. Okay. So I'm I'm confident going to the exit now and 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 go on home. Yep. I knew I couldn't climb down that. Maybe I could find a way to drain the putrid water. I thought I just did that. Damn it, I just did all of that. <sighs> Fucking bitch. Yay, I'm a genius. I can go down now. I am not a genius, that took way too long. Look like the water drained out of the grate in the wall. Metal key. Yeah, take it. I know I have a lot of shit in my pockets right now. <laughs> when I mean my, I mean your pockets, Bob. Because you're the one walking around in this dank ass sewer right now. All by yourself with a fucking flashlight. Knowing that you've done at least killed two people. Come on, Bob. Come on. Ugh. Who would build 
shit down here. You know, oh, Bob. Oh, Bob. Look what you've done. Yeah. Oh boy. You are just you're a fucking hot mess, Bob. Let's find out. So is this the way out? Hmm. I feel like you were hinting at me, Bob. And you wanted some answers. Creepy. I do see you, Ladder. Yeah, why not? <laughs> why not? Uh, seriously, why not? This is a fun little adventure game, but so far, it's really not horror. I would say it's more... Oh, what happened up here? I would say it's more... Uh, yeah, I think it's more like adventure crime or, or mystery. Beatable wallet, Ch yeah, check it out. What's in it? Oh, the gun permit. Oh, dang it, it's not a gun permit. All right, well, that was a waste of time to get a beat up old wallet, doesn't even have anything in it. Let's move along here, Bob. I'm getting off task. Shit. Is there anything back here? There is not. Oh, what was that? There's nothing. Oh, am I just on the other side of the gate now? I guess I am. What? Um, wait, I, I went through. A little. Okay. Hmm. What the fuck are you doing? I'm sorry, am I just rummaging? Was I just rummaging? <laughs> Why are you rummaging in the bushes, dude? You're freaking me out, Bob. Move along, man. Jesus. Hey. Hey. Wait a minute. There was something on the ground here. Oh. 
Wait, what? What the fuck? That is different. This is weird. Bob. Bob, I, I think we're tripping out, man. Shit.